Hey everyone. I have a methylene blue blog post coming out shortly and I wanted to just share with you a few things that I think um, is exciting. I think methylene blue is an important tool in our toolbox when we think about uh, mitochondrial health for one. Um, and I think mitochondrial health is one of sort of the underappreciated parts of uh, dealing with complex chronic illnesses, such as mast cell activation syndrome. Um, it's certainly only one component. Um, it's certainly not um, for everyone, and there are lots of reasons, you know, why it, it may not be for you. But um, what I'm excited about is the use of methylene blue combined with red light therapy. You know, a lot of you have heard me speak about red light. Um, I just did my my red light uh, bed in the office a short time ago, a short while ago. Um, and what I'm experimenting with personally, but also with my patients, is using a low dose of methylene blue. Um, we're doing it orally um, for a lot of patients and then followed with the red light therapy. We're also doing IV methylene blue <clears throat> followed by the red light. And there are a few reasons for this. One is that that combination increases energy production uh, from the mitochondria. Um, and but but also one of the things that I'll be talking a lot about, I'll be doing a bunch of reels on methylene blue is we're going to talk about its role as a um, antimicrobial agent. And that combination with red light improves its ability to, uh, we'll use that term, kill um, certain certain types of infections. Um, so stay tuned um, and um, hopefully you'll learn more. Thank you. Bye.